welcome this is the energy vibration reading for the Virgo Sun Moon Horizon sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration for you Virgos it is the week and your message already is flying out for the center of the week it is the week um, of the 26th of August until the 1st of September if this is your birthday between the 26th of August until the 1st of September you Virgos please 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 go check out the birthday readings okay please go check out the birthday readings so whatever that is going on for um, you Virgos go check out your birthday reading so whatever is happening for you Virgos go check out your birthday readings you Virgos because it is in um, it is good whatever is transpiring for you Virgos it is a good positive energy vibration that is happening okay so Virgo Sun Moon Horizon sign. So for you Virgos, let's check out and see what is going on. I'm sorry, <laughs> I thought I saw someone who I knew. Okay, so Virgos, now you're seeing exactly what is going on. It is your zodiac energy vibration for this week. It is the Earth energy also. So whatever you were blind or you weren't seeing clearly, now you are seeing this situation very clearly what is happening what is transpiring whatever that was going on you Virgos are now seeing everything as clear as day about people in power it could be about your boss it could be about your supervisor whatever it is it's about people in power you are seeing clearly what exactly had happened what exactly had transpired the lies and deceptiveness with people in power what they have done okay so let's see what else is coming out it has to do with your financial stability so some of you are seeing what is happening with your financial stability um, you're protected and you're protecting yourself from people in power or people who try to use their power um, that is definitely coming up then I'm seeing you Virgos are coming up especially at work you're going to be successful um, if you have a business at work you're definitely going to be um, successful I told you <laughs> I told you Virgos money is going to be coming in um, in this week if you have a business you're going to be successful money is going to be coming in in this week I'm seeing some of you who are married or in long-term relationship financial um, situation um, Pisces cancer or a scorpion some of you if you're in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion I am seeing financial stability I'm seeing this person is going to be helping you out financially okay so let's look um, with a relationship what is transpiring in this week with relationship is that I'm seeing issues over but it's not really issues to be honest it's not really issues I have to say it's not really issues whatever that is happening whatever that is transpiring it's not really issues I'm seeing that you're building on your financial stability then we see that you're protecting yourself whatever is transpiring you're protecting yourself from people in power it could be your supervisor or your manager or so you're protecting yourself from these person because you're seeing the truth some of you are protecting yourself you're seeing the truth about the Pisces cancer or scorpion we're going to be looking to see what exactly is happening here with these people and the situation okay definitely your wishes and dreams is going to be coming in especially when it comes on to money your wishes and dreams is going to be coming in um, if you have a business your wishes and dream definitely is going to be coming in business is going to be good for you let's take a look and see what is happening with the four of Pentacles and the nine of ones four of Pentacles and the nine of ones is that some of you were uh, in some hardship some of you um, who are in relationship your marriage your wedding 
um, whatever is happening maybe um, this is not working out for you there is some issues with your relationship or marriage if you are in a soulmate relationship long-term relationship twin flame relationship there could be some issues and you're trying to protect yourself now justice comes up against your boss justice came up against your boss or someone in power so let's say that someone in power it could be your boss it could be your supervisor it could be someone who tries to play boss over you it could also be an Aries but this is coming up as someone who is in authority justice came up on this person so you're protected from this person justice came up from on this person because of what they have done they have done some injustice lies and deceptiveness there was an um, investigation that has taken place with people in authority whatever it has to do it can that people in authority people um, the the headmaster of a school or a, 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 an, an institute the organization where you study whoever that plays power over you there's an investigation that came over this person and justice came in so this person or this whoever plays it um, and that's why you are going to be uh, it's as if they have to pay you a lot of money for what has transpired okay they have deliberately um, done something injustice to you and they have to pay you a lot of money is as if some injustice had transpired and they have to pay you a lot of money now I'm seeing that you um, some of you are being is as if they're say your partner is saying yes and you're seeing someone and there is no one that you're seeing so some of you are having relationship problems that your partner is accusing you of something and it's not true okay so it's as if your wife or husband or your partner is accusing you of seeing someone and it's not that it's just that there is some medical issues that you do not want to speak about and you do not want to tell your partner exactly what is going on but it's as if they're arresting you and uh, you know saying that you're seeing someone but you're not seeing someone it's just that some of you have a lot of work and some of you have some medical issues that you don't want to talk about and I think people have the right to just don't talk about it if they don't want to talk about it you're married to someone but you don't have to give them your own life okay all right I don't know what is happening with you and a Pisces cancer or a scorpion but it's as if you're seeing something about this person and it's a no so whatever you're thinking about a Pisces cancer or a scorpion it is a no <laughs> it is for someone out there whatever you're seeing about a Pisces cancer or a scorpion it is a no okay so um, because the energy of the lover if you are married or in a relationship with a Pisces cancer or scorpion and you're thinking that this person is seeing someone else or something like that it is a no okay it is a no so um, there um, now um, as we look at what it is that you're seeing clearly what it is that you're seeing clearly is the um, a young Pisces cancer or scorpion so this this energy is coming up as uh, um, this young person could be coming to you this young person could be returning to you this young person wants to return to you but it is like no don't let them in do not let them in so a lot of you are dealing with these uh, um, it's it's kids it's kids that is coming up I'm seeing um, if you're dealing with a young person a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn justice comes up on no sorry if you are dealing with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion justice comes up on this person whatever the issue is and whatever the situation is justice came up on this person and it's as if they want to return in your life and it's a no do do not don't do it okay you could be in a relationship with this person also but I'm seeing it um, that this person could be a child if you have a child with an a Pisces cancer or a scorpion um, this child could be returning okay um, so and but whatever it is is a no 
So this child, whatever this child has done, it is like the universe is saying, no, you have learned from this. Okay. So some of you are going to be finding out something about your partner, whatever the issue is, whatever the situation is, some of you are going to be finding something out about your partner and about their financial stability. Okay. But it's not bad. It's um, actually something good, so don't worry about it. But some, some of you are going to be finding out if you are married to a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, or in a relationship, or it could be your father, or it could be um, a family member or so, I am seeing that you're going to be receiving some good news um, from them, and they're going to be telling you something about money. So it could be extra money that is coming in or they're going to be leaving you some money or you have won some money or they are going to have to pay you whatever it is I'm seeing um, the nine of cups your wishes and dreams coming true about a money situation and a money issue now there is definitely um, some of you it could be your kids because I'm seeing kids coming up and I'm seeing people in authority and I'm seeing um, it's as if some of you are dealing with a young person, a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion between the age of 18 and 45, whoever this person is and whatever the situation that is going on, I'm seeing an effect that is coming up where there was some issues that has transpired. Okay. What I'm also seeing is that, um, whoever had financial instability if you were married in if you're married in a relationship and you have some financial instability um, a lot of conflicts is going to come up but you are protected there is nothing to worry about just let it be sometimes these things transpire and uh, all the universe is saying is that next time that when you have a lot uh, keep it for yourself and don't give it out this is all the universe is saying some of you who think that your partner is cheating, no, they're not. They're not cheating. Cheating. There is nobody else. Um, so whatever is is happening or whatever is transpiring, no, they're not cheating. I'm seeing some um, unexpected news about money is going to be coming in. This is going to be good. People who had issues with people in power and they have used their powers against you, um, this is going to be resolved and it is going to be very, very positive. It's going to be ending very positive. Let's check out and see what else is happening for you guys. Spring, your desire full, um, fully manifests as the flowers begin to bloom. So in spring, for some of you, if you had a question, you were asking about something it's going to be happening in spring so for the you guys who had a question about something um it is going to be happening in the springtime so you virgos yeah whatever you are open and wishing for it's going to be happening in the springtime so virgos thank you for being here remember the monthly readings are going to be coming out on monday they will be published on monday i love you guys namaste until next time